say rocks. All right, this is rocks. Applebee's rocks. <laughs> Get freaking to get you Applebee's rocks. Plus, you know what else is awesome? What else is awesome, Dan? Our hotel is awesome. Our hotel is awesome. Our... <laughs> Our hotel has a hot tub, a pool... A fitness center. A king-size bed. In each room. Laundry fa <laughs> Laundry <laughs> facility. Continental <laughs> breakfast. That is awesome. The food is so good. As apparently we're Dan's margarita. <laughs> good morning. Good morning. So what are we going to work on after breakfast, though? Um, I have to work on my lines. I'm going to work on Katie's lines. And then I'm going to eat a nice cinnamon roll. <laughs> cinnamon roll. So last week was a little tough, but this week, we actually feel like we're at an Idaho country club. This is a view from our hotel. It's pretty cool. I'm still trying to figure out these mountains because it kind of just looks like a big sandbox. Maybe tonight. Okay. An hour later, though, you should call now. But we had... Mm. Alb... 
feta cheese salad apple. With a walnut. We have chicken enchiladas. <laughs> and we are sitting outside of... <laughs> Happy Puppies! Dan's a little upset right now. He's a little bit stressed about the backstage stuff, but once you're not sat down, <laughs> he's kind of snapping a bit, but that's okay. Dan, what did you think of the show? I thought the show went fine. The problem is, there's so much going on, that's the problem. I believe I said the same thing last week. Exactly. So, like, the problem is the whole empathy-sympathy thing. Like, I don't know. Like, you want to really care, and it's awesome. But it's stressful! <laughs> So, right, Katie? Yes. The interesting thing this week is the kids that had questions about everything. Absolutely everything. Starting day one, we tell them not to ask questions about the next day. We'd answer them later. They would ask questions anyway. They all back all they ask questions about when's the show going to be over? When's the show going to be over? When's the show going to be over? What are we doing? What are we doing? What show are we doing? It's over when it's over. Are you going on stage, Dan? No. Have I been on stage yet? Clearly, I won't be going on stage. Despite our frustrations, the show was really good. It really was, though. Really we had a little toy soldier that wouldn't go on stage until the moment that he actually decided to go on stage. And it was the cutest thing ever. The second because he went from bawling to, like, ecstatically excited and jumped up in this place. And that completely made it all worth it. And then can you tell about your story with the whale? Oh, so, when a jip head with Strombolo Lee sees Pinocchio getting into the ocean to swim, we're standing at the edge of the stage, kind of like pointing, look, there's a whale. Well, 70 kids who are watching the show proceeded to stand up and turn around, looking back at the gym wall, looking for the whale. And they kind of turned back to listen some more, and I, I pointed out how he could be swallowed up, and they all turned around to watch it. There's nothing there. That stuff makes it all worth it. 